In this video, I'm going to walk through how you can add a domain to your Odoo database. As you can see, I already added my domain to this database, and I'm going to walk through the steps that I used in order to get this to work. It's fairly simple, but the process is a little bit different depending on your domain provider. I am using GoDaddy for my domain provider. The first thing you want to do is go into your domain provider. I have this open on this screen here. You're going to try to find the DNS. So we're going to look for our DNS. Our, we're going to manage zones here. So DNS manage zones. And then on every different domain provider, this is going to be slightly different. So you may want to Google how to get there on your particular provider. But essentially, you'll end up getting to these records here. And you can search, you know, it, you might be using Google domains. You can search how to add a C name to Google domains or any domain provider you use in order to figure out how to get to this page. It's really simple process from here. Once you get here, you want to add your C name record. So essentially all we need to do is add a new record and we're going to say it's a of type C name and the host or the name depending on what provider you're using we usually usually name this differently so this is going to be www and we're going to point it to your odoo database name so my original odoo database name was reordering dash kez dot odu dot com and then we have this TTL which is time to live and this is the amount of time it will take to go live at a maximum it usually takes quick so if I put a custom here and I do 600 seconds I can save this and it will be up and running within 600 seconds usually it's it's much quicker than that um, so I already have that set so I'm not going to set it again but that's essentially all you have to do here and then you can also turn on your domain forwarding so if I go to edit right here we can see that we have forward all of our requests to our website to www.kzaki.com and this makes sure that if you're using your domain as a base domain without a www that it all redirects or forwards to www.kzaki.com and we see this is a permanent redirect now the next thing you want to do is go over to your odoo dashboard so this is odoo.com you log into odoo.com you go to my databases so this is going to bring up your database page and you're going to find your database. You probably have a lot less than I do, but these are all test environments. And you're going to find the one database that you want to connect to. Mine is, let me double check here, reordering. So we have this right here and we're going to click the gear icon and we're going to go to domains. And you're simply going to type in www.yourdomain.com as you see up here and click add. And this is all you have to do to connect your domain to Odoo. And now you'll have a nice looking domain as you can see secure https www.kzaki.com and this brings us to our Odoo backend portal.